Hello everybody and welcome to my video on how to make a, your own custom cursor for the game Osu. Um, so, right off the bat, let's just get started. Go to your start menu, go to computer, and go to Windows C, go to program files 86, go to Osu, skins, and make a new folder. I already made a new folder for the purpose of this, so... Yeah, just uh, make a new folder in there. And then down, uh, it'll be in the description, but download this um, program called GIMP2. Works totally fantastic for making these cursors. So when you have GIMP downloaded, just open it. Alright, so when, that <coughs> when that's uh, downloaded, yeah, let's expand this. What you're going to want to do is go to new, and it'll be 640 by 400, so go 128 by 128. And this is really important right here, go to advanced options, go to fill with, transparency, and OK. Alright, next what you're going to do is, well, is go to the bottom left of the editing thing, and it'll say 100% over here. Just do the drop down menu and go to 400%. Alright, so now we have this, so we're going to want to have it centered. So go up to Image, go to Guides, New Guide by Percent, and you can either choose which one at the beginning, it doesn't really matter, but to, for the first one, just pick one and it should go like that. Next, go up to Image again, go to Guides, New, by perc new Guide by Percent, and just select the other option. So now we have this nice, fine thing here. Next thing what you're going to want to do is go to the left side panel and do this. It, it automatically has the airbrush tool, but that's not what we need. We need the paintbrush tool here. So you have the, um, the paintbrush, go to the right panel, and it should be selected on this, this type of thingy. Go to the right to the big black, uh, the filled in black circle. Alright, now go back over to the left, go to size, and go to 75. Alright, so we're this far, so next what you're going to want to do is pick a foreground color, or, you know, let's just do changing color, it doesn't really matter what it's called, but pick a color, so we'll just do We'll do blue and select that. All right, next what you're gonna want to do is just go to the middle and do that. So that's a nice blue circle we got right there. If you want layers, go to size and go down by about by five or ten. I recommend ten. That's usually what I do. And select a different color. So orange goes pretty good with blue, I think. That's kind of an ugly blue. Orange. That's better. Alright, so and then when you select a different color, just hit the middle again, and it should overlap the blue. And by the way, to switch colors, you just go to, um, you go to your colors on the left, on the top left, and there's a little tiny, uh, what do you call it, switch, switcheroo thing, I don't know, I'll just call it that. So, and I kind of recommend this, but your last layer you're going to want to do should be white. So, I, th I think that works pretty good when you're playing Osu. So, for the w this is just going to be a really simple cursor, so when you have white selected, just do that once more. Alright, now to upload it to Osu, you're going to want to go to, first you want to go to Image, you're going to want to do Scale Image, and do, um, what I do personally is 200 by 200, which we will do. Because I think when you're playing also, it, it's a pretty good size. And when you hit tab, it should just change the height to 200 also. So next, you want to hit scale, and it should be like that. Next, what you're going to want to do is go Control Shift E and name it. Uh, let's name it Video Cursor times two. Alright. Just 
so I'll just name it and make sure you have the times too so you don't get one, get them mixed up or I'll just show you in a little bit alright go to Windows C I'm not sure what it is for Mac so I'm pretty sure you should be able to find that out go to program files 86 scroll down and find OSU go to skins and go back to the that new folder we got here that we created at the beginning right click that and I'll just get that out of here whatever um, I'll do export and then I'll just okay I'll just replace it I had to do this a few times because I was screwing up alright so we got that when you have that new folder when you go in there to export it that that other video cursor shouldn't be in there that's just my thing there alright and then what you're going to do now is go to image go to scale image again and do half so 100 by 100 so we got that <coughs> go control shift E and just name it cursor and then um, save it in the exact same folder which it should already be there so export there we go so now if we open OSU so you can exile that, you can save it if you want, it doesn't really matter exit out of that, I'm gonna open OSU alright so after you uploaded your um, your cursor you're gonna wanna go into OSU and go to click OSU go to options so I'm already there and on the left side panel here you're gonna wanna scroll down to skin it should be under volume or universal audio offset so go to skin and go to select skin so as we see here uh... Yeah, I'll just select this um... as we see here I got my uh... knife party cursor here so all you gotta do is go to click on new folder and there we go in my next video I'm going to show you guys how to uh, get the trail like see how I'm here and then kind of following it with the new with the new one that we made that doesn't have one so hopefully you guys found this educational uh, leave a like if you did and comment see you